Saddlers TV, bringing you closer to Warsaw Football Club. So Joe, how does it feel to be a Saddler? Yeah, I'm delighted. Um, it's obviously a fantastic club here and they had a, a really good season last year. So uh, to get the opportunity to play here, um, work under the manager who's, who's been great with me and I've met him a few times now. So it was really exciting and I can't wait to get started. What was the attraction to join Warsaw? Um, it's just such a nice, friendly club when you come every time you come here, and obviously the success they had last year. Unfortunately, they didn't quite make it the last hurdle, but the whole season they were they were brilliant. They play play lovely football, and like I said, it's just a it's just a nice, enjoyable club to, to join. You played against Warsaw before for for Yeovil and, yeah. uh, and Colchester last season. What have you made of the Saddlers when you come up against them? They've always been a very good football inside. Um, I had to pass it about, but amongst that, they're very good uh, defensively, high intensity, and. Uh, they got a good, real good team spirit about them, um, which obviously attracted me to this club and it's something that I like to be a part of. And what have you made of John Whitney as well? What do you have to say to convince you to come here? Well, like I said, yeah, we had a meeting a couple of weeks ago and um, I came away thinking, yeah, this is, this is the club for me. You know, sometimes it just feels right and the, and the fits, and it fits perfect. Um, he's a very enthusiastic guy who, like I said, can have a laugh and a joke, but I'm sure he can be very serious at times when you need to be. So, like I said, he really impressed me and hopefully I impressed him, which is that's why we came to this agreement. Yeah, for those fans who perhaps aren't too sure, what type of player are you? I think you can play midfield and a uh, fullback as well, can't you? Yeah, I'm, I'm very versatile, so I've got a, got a few positions which, uh, which I don't mind playing in. Um, like I always say, I'm, I'm happiest when I'm playing and I'll give 100% in every game, um, commitment-wise, but on and off the ball. Um, so I'm s someone that hopefully the fans will enjoy watching. Um, uh, not necessarily too much flair, but I'll give, like I said, 10 out of 10 every week. Um, and I'll do my best for the team. And you've experienced success this level before as well with your promotion 2013. Yeah. Was you really keen to try and repeat that perhaps this season? Yeah, exactly. And, and when you get those promotions in your career, you want to you wanna keep doing it again and again and again. And that was the feel I got here, is that it's like a, a nice uh, club where everyone's in it together and there's a real good team spirit. Um, and that's what we had at Yeovil, which is why we were successful. We weren't the biggest club with the biggest budget, but we had a, a very good manager and a very good bunch of players who all stuck together and, and fought for the shirt. And finally, uh, have you set yourself any targets for the season ahead? Just to have a very successful one. Um, like I said, we'd like to build on, build on what they did last year. Um, if we can get to the, that level again and then go one step better, then even better. And like I said, I just can't wait to get started here and, and get back to playing football.